All right, so Chelsea just walked next door to the gas station, um, but I think this is a good opportunity to show you how we line up our trailers. Do you see the rail, uh, like right there in your guys' view? Now on the driver's side, you can see that. On the passenger side, you can't right now. Um, so we would be able to line up the dumpster either way, but if you're going perfectly straight, it's kind of hard to see. But I'm going to back up to this dumpster and we're going to line that rail up with those vertical supports on the dumpster itself. So now I'm going to swoop kind of the opposite way and swing back so that I can see it. See it come back into view there? And I'm just going to slowly work my way back to the dumpster and we're going to take that rail and line it up with that vertical support. I know it's kind of hard for you guys to see. I'm going to swoop back a little bit. I know I'm in the right vicinity. Um, well, that was kind of a bad example. I don't know. Can you see over there how that rail is lined up with that dumpster? It is literally that easy. You see it over here? I don't know. Can you guys see that? Let me know. That is literally how easy it is to line these trailers up that simple I know it does take some practice but now I'm gonna back up Oop, a little bit too far I bumped it I'm gonna back up just close so that I know I'm six inches away when my stingers get down to the ground I'll be able to just hook the winch right up I won't have to back up again it is that simple with the Nedlin setup I don't know how other people line theirs up there is absolutely no need for a backup camera there is no no need whatsoever and you can do this almost every single time exactly like I showed you it is very very simple see here how these rails line up right there it is super super simple I see a lot of people are struggling with this with other trailers I don't know how it works with other trailers but for us that's how we do it very 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 simple and very convenient um, no backup camera needed whatsoever Now you can see when you get perfectly close, these stingers, what we call the stingers, I don't know what the proper term is, we call them the stingers, but they're basically going to touch these wheels, so there's no need, once you get used to it, there's no need to bring your stingers down and then back up to the dumpster if you do it right. I mean, you're not going to do that every time, but I mean you can see there's like an inch right there. Just like that. Well, obviously we are at the yard. We've got a 15. This one's going out. Uh, one that we sold this morning. Um, the 10 is going out. The 20 is going out at 6 a.m. Monday. And I think we have only one 15 that we can sell yet today. Um, once we get... I think uh, the 20 that we're going to go pick up is actually sold uh, Monday as well. So... We're staying, we're staying right where we want. The problem right now is we're expecting 12 more dumpsters soon. But in the meantime, I can't really afford to do more marketing without more dumpsters. We've kind of found a sweet spot with our marketing and the amount of dumpsters that we have. Now, when we get these 12 new ones, it is going to be different. We 